there are and things and stuffs and peoples. Hello, everyone. We're back with our slightly delayed normal stream. Yep. I feel like I didn't get any rest with that nap. But okay, woke up a little bit early and then she decided... Oh! Wow, uh, this is very disorganized. What better time to reorganize it than to, for it to be when it eats into our sleep? And that's usually the best time. Yeah. Mm -hmm. mm. Feels like we've been feeling sick a lot lately. We never did go back and get those armored enemies broken by boost attacks. Not for lack of trying. Whoops. We will when we figure out why it keeps happening. Mm. Hello, Jake. Jake. Hello, Drake, and hello, Jules. And thanks for the high, Drake. Ooh, it's NPC saved. Okay. Hello, Jake. Hello, Jails. Hello, Adiance. Hello, Jake, and hello, Drools. I don't want to call her Drools. That's just mean. It's just to play on how I misspoke. Yeah, but your misspeak wasn't mean to Drake. I mean, I'm not trying to be mean. I'm just making fun of how I misspoke. Making fun of myself there. Uh, advanced subquest of Bibliophile. No, J. Oh, the pronunciation is basically the same, isn't it? Yes. I was going jails. <laughs> Ooh, what's this one? Meal cooked roasted chicken. Write that down, write that down. Wait, what? I need to cook roasted chicken as Alfin. Yeah, I realized that on hindsight. <laughs> Faster AG recovery, probably good. I have nothing marked for you. Why do I have nothing marked? Oh, Dohalim also gets 10 hit boost gauge increase. Start casting time during combos. This is probably better. <laughs> yep. I wish he set up a coffee before taking her nap. Uh. Subquest walking crack. No, you can do it. No, I'm going to do it. Oh. We're about to enter a new area, right? Uh, yes. I think once we break into the new area that we could sort of... That'll be fine. I know. Once we break into the new area, well, we could get acclimated and while you're in the middle of being in the field, being a monsters. I'll go ahead and take care of my pre-stream stuff on stream. As per usual. I, I just feel like the first altar in every stream is Potter to start off stream. <laughs> Not the worst for some of us. 
Uh -oh. Dead button. Wall. Huh. I think Hodel senses something. Mahog Sar. That makes four out of the five realms that I've visited now. I wonder what kind of lord we're gonna find there. It doesn't matter. If they try to get in our way, we'll take them down and that'll be that. <sighs> Is this our trip the game? I'll hold on to that. Yeah, basically. Huh. Where? That glare is awful even in a video game. Okay. Well, that's a monster encounter. Oh yeah, I forgot to rearrange. Not that. Uh. Oh, can you not switch between who's in the front and who's in the back? Yeah. Okay. That's pretty standard fare for any game that has more than the party's amount of party members, which is every game. Yeah, but I wasn't sure how it would work. And I didn't really try to do it when we only had five. You had five for a while. I'm surprised you took the ball. It just didn't come up. It wasn't something I wanted to do. Why do you want to do it now? <laughs> I was going to play as Dohalim. Did you not want to play uh, Kisara at all? Kisara? I played Kisara. We had her in the main party. We had Law taken out. You don't want to play Law? At the time, no. I really didn't want to play Law. Why didn't you want to play Law? Poor guy. He... Why would I want to play Law? Oh, right, 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 right. Tree branches. Oh. You're right. The tree branches. No, turn around, turn around. Oh, the tree branches. Oh my god, turn around. Oh, 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 oh. A devil tip. Wait, didn't we already have... Yeah, it's devil horns and devil wings. Oh, you're right. We have to switch the wings for the tail. Why do we have three devil attachments? Okay. Uh, first that, second that. Law just never gets any luck in this party. Third. Da, 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 da. This is actually a tough choice now. Is there anyone you want me to keep in the main party? Oh. Actually, I would say Law because it feels like he has been out for a pretty good amount of time. Want to take out Alphina and Xion? Not really on Xion, just because Pat, uh, AI healer. You mean by now two of our other party members? She only really heals herself, and if I'm going to be actively playing Dohalim. Oh. Yeah, all right. I'll try this. Oh, right. The other part of... One crown. Fancy. Two double tail. Oh, I have a thought. Hmm... Well, Dolim's kind of filler 
sixth right now, right? Kinda, just because we don't have a sixth set. What if we did? I don't oh. really see the tail. How does he look with double wings? Oh. Up. Oh, do. It works. And then give Kisser the tail. Yeah. People shouldn't be left without their tail. I I think the tail works better for Kisser than. Well, I don't know. Maybe the wings will generally work better, but this works good enough. <laughs> The wings aren't really interfered with. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I would go straight to the entrance. Yeah. I mean, it's not exactly mini offshoot. Oh, Fish. it's taking us over this way. Oh, do we finally learn how to fish in the fourth region? Pond here. Yeah, this is Taka Pond, and it happened to have saved my life once upon a time. What do you mean? As a kid, I survived life under the ah, past lords by ponds. escaping here when I needed to. It's terrible to swim in, but great for catching a bite for dinner away from Ren and Oz. <laughs> Bear in mind, our rations back then weren't enough to live off of. You had to take matters into your own hands if you wanted enough food to survive. But how did you catch them? With your bare hands? That might take a while. Fish are prone to swim away at the first sign of trouble. I'd put bait or a lure on a line That's and right, use it with a fish. fishing rod. You must not be familiar yeah, with fishing if fish. this sounds new to you. Here, let me show you how it's done. Various fishing points are scattered around Dana, which contain different species of fish to catch. This fish can then be used in cooking, sold for gold, or even unlock new titles, so don't hesitate to try new fishing holes. Fishing consists of four steps. Casting a line, luring fish, hooking them, and then reeling them in. For more information about these steps, consult the fishing controls topic. Neck tails. They're comfy and easy to wear. I hope we catch something decent. Indeed. Hungry bellies are counting on this. Uh, to, to, to break uh, uh. Okay. Reel it in. Okay. Okay. Dramatic battle. Interesting. Well, that wasn't much of a challenge. That went pretty well. Pond tilapia. One star. We could do better than one star. Let's go again. There we go. So there's a uh, direction input and button input. Yep. Oh, you should. There it is. Anybody could reel in that. <laughs> Not too shabby, friend. I don't know if we could. <laughs> Can I try a couple times? That first pond tilapia might have been on the larger side. So, pick a spot, you hit right trigger to cast it out. And then you hit either X or Y to <laughs> cause the ring to show up on the left. Hit A when the ring's in the uh, cyan rings. So hit X or Y, you'll see what I'm saying. 
hit A when that circle. All right, once is... more from the top. Oh. Not B. I've got something. Yep. <sighs> And then this part's fairly self-explanatory. All right, that went pretty well. Anybody could reel in that. That went pretty well. Dan and Bass. Oh look, OBS went to do its disappearing trick again. That's strange. I've got something. Yes. Anybody could reel in that. That went pretty well. All right. You want to go ahead and we'll move on. One more go. Okay. One more go. Mm. Let's try. All right. Actually, wait. That looked like a beak fish out there. Hmm. Yeah. It might have just been the angle on the mountain. Oh. Oh. That's going to take a few. We got this. All right. <laughs> I did it, but I'm not gonna quit now. You tend to another Dan and Bass. Big, big one. Yeah, seventy-one point four inches. Inches? I don't know. Doesn't look like inches. But I can save the world with fishing. What games are legally required to have a fishing mini game? Did that actually show up on screen? Uh, now where might those fish be? Okay, I don't know if uh, those past few messages actually showed up in stream. Unfortunately, I don't have anything to see that. Hmm. Hey, what do you think about that? Oh, yes, being weird. Good idea. I'll go for that one. Funny how she talks about she's not done yet, and that's. Yes, we are. <laughs> yeah. And that's all there is to it. Wow. It seems like you need to have good reflexes to catch anything. I don't know if it's really for me. Kisara? I think I've seen enough. <laughs> oh, sorry. I guess I'm just in my own little world when I go fishing. Looks like we're going to be here for a while. That's how fishing goes. You wait for a bite, and then the real battle begins. Magal told me that different fish live in different regions, and you have to pick the right rod and lure for what you're hoping to catch. But that doesn't change the fact it's a giant time sink. Of course, each fish has its own unique flavor, too. And some of them are supposed ah, to be... Ah, now she's speaking Xion's delicious. language. <laughs> like that, maybe it's worth me trying my hand at fishing after all. You're just in it for the food. I was hoping we'd get to fish during our travels. And it just so happens I made sure to grab my brother's old rod before I left Vicent. So, if you ever feel like fishing when we've got a little downtime, just let me know. Good to hear. Thanks for showing us. We don't know if that another test message actually showed up. Hey. hey, you look like you know your way with a rod. I've been fishing a long time and I've built up a good collection of equipment for it. I'll share it with you if you're interested. I just want one thing in exchange. All I ask is for you to show me records of any fish you catch. The more you catch, the more equipment I'll hook you up with. <laughs> if you need anything, I'm always here. 
Don't be afraid to come up and talk to me. Does fishing have its own currency? Uh, fishing expert found at Talka Pond can teach you basics. Show him your notes. He'll tell you where to go to catch fish you haven't found, as well as giving you new fishing gear based on how much uh, how much you've caught. Gals rod, beginner's popper. An invitation fish, fish. to fish. Fish. Skilled angler. Speeds up the rate of AG recovery because we know how to fish. Igneous discharge. Strikes the ground, sending rocks flying. Oh, just uh, two messages there. Okay. Why? Hmm? Why only then? What's OBS up to? Hopefully there's an update that'll fix this. I think that's the issue, because there was a recent update. Yeah, I'm hoping for a hotfix that'll fix that. Hmm. Like that one of the other characters caught it a time waste. <laughs> yeah, until she realized there was food involved. Oh, Kisara gets KO prevention. I'll do a little bit of setup. And I'll check out the new area when we're open up back. Sounds good? Mm hmm. Uh, let me take some fishing notes. Overseer Heel, uh, Hill, Frozen Valley, Navira Snow Plains. Okay, so one more type of fish. Okay. If you need anything, I'm always here. Don't be afraid to come up and talk to me. Oh no, there's a guard. What do you say? Whew, you're a real lifesaver. You're a lifesaver. Where'd I get real from? Ugh. Now I can get back to my miss. Sorry, forget I spoke. Carry on. Don't mind me. Infantry shield. I'm oh. always amazed what healing arts can do. Just doing my job. No need to thank me. Okay. That would be... Well, it's weaker, but at least we get the design. That's... Quite the design on there. Ooh, that looks so good. Uh... Might as well since we're here. I already checked them. Blackthorn. Do do do. Do do do. Ooh. Didn't mean to back all the way out. <laughs> oh, it just wasn't loading. Secrets of the Galaxy. No book found. Eh, I'm good leaving it at where it's at. And... Do, 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 do. Da, 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 da. Yeah, that's fine. I changed a couple. And then cutscene. Ah, uh? game. <sighs> Okay. Is it just me, or have those two barely spoken a single word to one another? I know, right? But after everything that happened with Nagal, 
Is it really any wonder? Kinda puts a damper on the whole journey, though, huh? How long do you think they're gonna keep this up? If it bothers you that much, why don't you ask them? <laughs> why do I have to ask? How come you walk together like that? Uh, she really doesn't beat around the bush. You mean Kisara and myself? You hadn't noticed? You've been practically joined at the hip ever since we left Vicent. I, I guess it's force of habit, most likely. I was always ready to protect him, should the need arise. It sort of came with the job description. Right. From being in the Elder Menencia Guard. Although, Dohalim's pretty capable of defending himself, isn't he? Having guards doesn't necessarily mean the one being guarded is weak. No one's perfect all the time. Even so, it's not like they're entirely wrong, Kisara. You're no longer in my employ, after all. <laughs> I don't know. Hate me I mean, if it's what she's used to and you're both Maybe. comfortable with it, then who are we to judge? But she doesn't serve him anymore. It isn't normal for her to keep following him around like she still does. You know, she's probably right. And a lot has changed over the last few days. I guess it wouldn't hurt to rethink our relationship in light of the new circumstances. Perhaps I'll give it some thought, after all. Does that sound all right by you? Of course. You might want to stop asking his permission for every little thing <laughs> while you're at it. <sighs> Sorry. It's not that easy, shaking off old habits. I'll probably need a little time to get fully used to it. Children, well. I've noticed that sometimes we come across enemies who fight like you and try to dodge our attacks at the last second. I hate those guys. I can get some hits in when they move in to attack, but otherwise they slip past damn near everything else I throw at them. Well, then get good, Law. If what you're seeking is a way to more reliably hit them, there is a solution. Try to outclass them on reflexes? <laughs> I possess the ability to command Earth elemental beings to some extent. They emerge as the land itself and take root on my command. They will swiftly bind the enemies, at which point you can dispatch them. Huh? Uh... What he means is that he can make plants grow to hold the enemies in place. At least I think that's probably what he's saying. <laughs> when even Kisra questions glad at it. I'm at least one of us understands him. So basically, if we find an enemy that likes to dodge, we should let Dohalim handle it. I shall do what I can within my modest means to help. <laughs> Dohalim's okay. biting style is... Uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Subdued? No. Do you mean elegant, perhaps? Yeah, that's the word. For better or worse, you can definitely tell he's cut from posh Renin cloth. <laughs> and he's not just skilled with a staff, either. He can also use astral arts, including healing ones. I can see how he made it to the position of a lord. You flatter me. But my fighting techniques merely come from a style that aims to conserve energy by minimizing body movement. That's minimizing? Is that why you wait until the last second before you dodge attacks? To avoid unnecessary movements? No, I do that to sharpen my senses. I find that doing so is an effective means of drawing out my innermost strength. Is this what you call a humble yeah, brag? I've noticed you look stronger and strike out with your rod more after you dodge attacks. Guess that's why. Still, it's a risk. Don't you ever worry you'll dodge at the wrong moment? Nope, I am then certain I'll dodge at the wrong well. moment. Huh? It's nothing. Let us continue. <sighs> hmm. Didn't miss much. Killed a guard right there. Changed some uh, uh, equipment looks. Hmm. Right. Made it about this far. Oh. Look at all the horse we got. I think we've restocked since the last update. Oh. Well, we don't have these armors, but they're all worse than... Well, the two of them are worse than what we've already got. Hmm. Do we get them anyways for collection's sake? Yeah. 
Doesn't every one of them make Elfin stronger? Outfits? Is it only the weapons? Oh, it is for purchasing. Weapons, we don't have the materials to craft anything. Okay. What did I need to make? Roast chicken? Yeah. Why are you looking at me like that? That armor you wear is standard issue for the Menensean Guard, right? Originally, I've added some flair to it in a lot of places. I noticed, especially with that open back. We guardsmen pride ourselves on never showing our back to our enemies. It's my way of making myself live up to that. Plus, it makes it that much lighter and easier to maintain. <laughs> hmm. Dohalin, do you have anything to say about this? Every guardsman is allowed to wear their armor as they see fit. And you, Law? Huh? Why are you asking me? Quick before resting. It has to be Elf and cooking the roasted chicken. Which we don't have. Which we don't have. Huh. Uh, do, 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 do. What's that increased cooking effect by 30% once remaining duration is less than half? Interesting. Huh. I must admit, I'm rather proud of this dish. Oh, we just had ourselves a lordly meal. Dohalim, care if I hang out for a while? Then they sit there, non-verbally, looking around at each other. I do believe it's about time that I retire. <laughs> yeah, I've made this a very awkward night, Elfin. Why did you call me out like this? <laughs> Shall we get moving? Uh, the coffee's probably ready by now. <laughs> Since there's something new to watch. Something feels odd here. Be on your guard. Uh, ooh. Multiple points of tra transit. Hmm. Coralist party? Oh. Careless I just noticed party. none of you other Danans have spirit cores. Why is that? Both of my parents were part of the resistance in Calaglia. In fact, my birth was kept a secret from the Renans. Mine too. We always lived in hiding, so I never had a spirit core embedded in me like I was supposed to. What about you, Alfin? You were a slave in Calaglia before all this, weren't you? To be completely honest, I'm not sure why I don't have one. All the other Danon slaves around me did. I was the only exception. They tended to keep their distance from me to avoid attracting any attention from the soldiers, because of my mask and all. What about you, Kisara? Do you still have your spirit core? No. I was able to find a good Renan doctor who's sympathetic to our kind, and had them remove it before I left. They did such a great job, the procedure didn't even leave a scar. <laughs> One of the benefits of coexistence, huh? I know that once the spirit vessel was shut down, there wasn't much need for me to hurry. But still, I didn't like having that mark of servitude lingering on me any longer than I had to. It may sound a little strange to hear me say this, but... I'm just me now. Not a guardsman or a slave. I'm my own woman. And this is my chance to have a new beginning. Yeah, good for you, Kisara. This sure is one rugged road. You'd think they'd keep this at least a little better maintained, right? Why spend energy fixing that which is rarely used? Repairs require time and effort, which in our world means slaves. Often in great numbers. Ah. 
For you, it may be a simple request, but that can quickly become another's difficult burden. Nobody gains anything without someone expending effort. And you know, somehow that someone always ends up being a Danon, while the Renans are the ones who gain. True enough. Ideally, in a perfect world, I think it's only fair that the ones who need it should be the ones to perform the work. However, when doing so could be dangerous like it is here, there are many who would prefer that it be others who risk their lives Or in people their who are more so in the profession. What you're saying profession? is that people will just put up with the inconvenience until someone else comes along to fix it for them? Yeah. Indeed. And it is those who can no longer bear that feeling that inevitably take action. Much like the Danans in our group do so now. As strange as it may be to hear such a thing from the likes of myself. It's true that most of the Danans in Calaglia have been resigned to just accepting things as they are. Still, we can't just blame them for... <sighs> what are you making that face for? You're not worn out already, are you? <sighs> nah, just regretting I ever said anything in the first place. <laughs> Awkward subject for him. Or it went on longer than he thought it would. Opal Mass, level four. What is getting into fights? Not something we do. Oh. Something we do, I guess. <laughs> this is a pain. Why can't the Zoogle stand still? All right. <laughs> Perhaps it's time I deploy my secret weapon. I'll stop it right where it stands. We've never even had trouble with evasive Zoogles. Growing vines from the ground to ensnare enemies and strike them. Effective on fleet-footed enemies. This nullifies their evasive abilities and downs them. No That's what would be called an evasive enemy? Okay. That does make them a lot easier to fight, though. Man, I cannot wait until mobile arts. It's possible he never gets them. That would be a shame. Success! When fast enemies like wolves or monkeys appear, send in Doalim. His boost attack will nullify their evasive abilities and keep them from dodging attacks. Heals on the bottom because didn't we have it on the top button for Xion? For the heal, yeah. Yeah. So, you know what? Before I keep messing that up, heal there, Aqua Serpent down there. Actually, you know what? No. Not even an arc down there. Raging Luna Storm. I also really appreciate that it uses her actual current shield. Oh, yes. fancy! Got some interesting moves there, Dohalim. I'm glad you're on our side. 
I'm simply glad to hear that I can make myself useful to you all. Huh? What's wrong? We seem to have come across some rather unusual objects. What, you mean that pile of garbage? No mere garbage, I assure you. Still, I've never seen anything shaped like it before. I'm intrigued. Uh, uh... Are you curious about this stuff, Rinwa? Uh, oh. Uh, yeah. I think he might have found some old Danon relics. Relics! They look like the remains of a bunch of objects that disappeared after the Renans first invaded. And yet here I am, holding them without so much as a second thought. I imagine this sight must be unsettling to you. Not really. Just that it must be nice to be a Renan who has time to indulge in stuff like that. Unlike the rest of us. God damn it, Renan. Uh, are you interested in this stuff too, Dohalim? Charmed may be a better turn of phrase. I simply love objects that can give me a sense of what their maker was thinking. The history that went into their creation. You see, we Renans have hardly any such objects that trace back to our distant past. I still don't understand what you two find so intriguing about it, though. Why not? We're talking about our own culture here. I get that, but it's not like this stuff is any use now, does it? It's just old. <laughs> Real old. Oh, but it does. Holding it in your hands like this, one can feel and engage with the distant past in a way no history book can ever accomplish. Argument of ages. I'll take your word for it. <laughs> well, seeing Quite literally. in history, just make sure you're careful with it. All right, Dohalim? But of course. Crocodile Crusher. This worn down hammer was used to beat back crocodiles. Those skilled enough to dual wield with it were lauded as champions. Confer special effects simply by having them. We're just now getting an artifact in, uh, tutorial. What? We can now set six additional art. Oh! Press Y on the art screen to switch between panels. Arts that are set to the second panel can be executed by pressing lift trigger on either Y, X, or A. Thank goodness we finally got that. There are way too many arts to just be stuck on three. <laughs> Which is ironic because four is a nice number for most of the games in our opinion. <laughs> but now we get six. Yeah. Uh, increase damage while rod extension. Rod extension time limit. Yeah, that. Yeah, no, that's more important. I tried to. There's history in the air here. I can smell it. I don't smell anything. Don't encourage him. <laughs> this should come in handy when crafting weapons. Uh, so let's check that. Uh, no. Still okay. Artifacts, second one. Yes. Art set plus one. Oh. That's just straight. Excuse me, we can have 23 pages of artifacts? I, I, oh, yeah, maybe. I guess it makes sense that the rest of these were from DLC. That's the white button? Ones you can toggle on and off. This one you can't. Hmm. Huh. Have a drink. Have a drink. Have a drink. Thanks. I definitely have that coffee ready. Uh. Yeah, I don't think Drake's message popped up again. That's weird. Like, that's kind of what I use, because it's, and I'm paying attention to the game that's more in the corner of my eye, like, more visible out of the corner of my eye. Ugh. Well, the benefit plus popping one does well. We could just sign a chat, not wonder back to you. <laughs> Sexual fear. Visibility along this path will remain limited for some time. Take care not to get ambushed. I'm surprised you know the terrain here so well. Lords don't strike me as having much time for wandering in the woods. Sometimes I would take strolls along here when I wished to be alone. You always did have a bad habit of disappearing without telling any of us guardsmen. 
I honestly thought Rinwell was gonna pop it. Must be nice to be able to take a stroll. Just, you want to be alone. Hmm. I think you have plenty of experience I was on mute. I think it was from drinking the water. So I think I didn't miss. Huh, enemies. Oh, chess. Must be nice being able to attack enemies. Kinda, yeah. Your last two messages did pop. Okay, apparently I'm just not seeing things. Well, it's better than seeing things. That's so I hear. That's what I hear. That's how they stand still and get hit by things. They do actually bounce back a lot, don't they? Oh, right. Nope. Uh, not that button. Man, that added so much. Yeah. Was uh, giving you a blank set? Yeah, yeah. Oh. So you have to set... Okay. You know, with that in mind, we don't need heal there. Uh, da -da -da -da. <laughs> what else do we want here? Crushes here. Surrounding enemy. Negative gate. Nope. Did not mean to clear that. Negative gate. There we go. So, I mean, at least with Dohalim, having the healing ones on the alternate set. Yeah. Or do you think those would still be better off? Like, oh, we want to heal. Specifically pause and do the thing. I would only do that for resurrection because you don't aim to die exactly. I don't know, but it makes sense gone. to have offhanded things like resurrection on there. Uh, <laughs> negative eight. Okay. All right, I am going to AFK a bit. Oh, negative jade looks fancy. It appears the end is nigh. I'll crush you. Held left trigger and hit up instead of uh, Y. <laughs> Whoops. Should make for some good weapon crafting material. That should make for some moderate money. It's hmm. so hilly around here. Okay, well, you know, I'll let them finish first. I can feel my feet getting blisters. That's mountain hiking for you. It can be pretty tough if you're not used to these sorts of trails. I take it you're comfortable with them then? Oh yeah. We used to run up and down these slopes all the time for our training exercises. Running up and down? Ugh. You weren't messing around. Ugh. Sounds awful. No. That button. No. That button. 
Let's do that, I guess. Leave Dohalim to his own devices a little bit. And then the first thing I do is hit the top button. Why? Why is that my first instinct? Turn, please. Thanks. Such thing as overdoing it against enemies. Do, 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 do. Might as well keep the battle chain going. No, a couple fights. Just as a plan. Got to see uh, Dohalim and Alphans combo attack, uh, strike. for the New Year's parties. Have a happy New Year. I'm glad you're able to... I'm glad you're being watching Jules. <laughs> oh. Hope you have a good time with the New Year's parties. What are we doing for Jules' birthday? Uh, wishing her a happy birthday? Oh. We're doing that. Wishing you a happy birthday. We barely do stuff for our own birthdays. Cybatos actively obscures our birthday. Thanks uh, for the hydrate. Nope. Thanks for the hydrate. <laughs> you are so worthy to the secrets of the birthday. And if you are still... Do we explore every nook and cranny or do we push forward? Every nook and cranny. Do you want to have a go since you're um, gone in a few minutes? Yeah. It'll be a breeze. Get in, get out. Like mom to the place. This on for some. Can you take it? Let's see. Law learned a new move. I like how that strike hit right as it was vanishing anyways. Uh, shouldn't we use law when they're guarded like that? Hmm. I should. Oh. 
That wasn't law. That wasn't law. That's still a cheesy but cool one. Huh? Uh nah, not really my thing. <laughs> Somewhere in the woods. Meeting in a cabin. Huh. Um, I hope to see you next week. Hope to see you at all. <laughs> Excuse me, rotating pile driver? I see what they were talking about with the Agile enemies now. <laughs> it wasn't immediately obvious. They haven't really been an issue up until now. But yeah, because we didn't have a character for it, so they didn't yeah. want us to deal with it. Oh, keep on breaking out of our combo. It's okay. She ought to bring you back. Kept getting attacked in the back when... Well, you shouldn't have turned your back to an enemy. You know you have no armor back there. Well, I was getting flanked if I turned my back to the enemy, then I would have gotten struck by the other enemy. That's when you leave to the side? Nah, that job would never work. Uh, that effect looks really cool because it's kind of like reality shattering there. Oh. That is a very... That's one way to use a shield, I guess. That's a very Iance attack. Which we would ever see if I and Sipper would attack. It played in the background for me. I saw it at first, but then after the battle, it blended. You were looking right at it after the battle. Yes, that's how camouflage works. You don't see things even if they're right in front of you. I'm not an idiot, but fine. I will say there is something that would be kind of nice to get before the end of the session today. Hmm. Uh, something I came across when I was looking up proficiency stuffs. Yeah. More damning rooms eh, here I'll too. Explain I later. See. What were people even thinking back then? Trying to build anything around here. M maybe they just had that much time and energy on their hands. Shh. Maybe this was an important site to them. Maybe it was less hostile. Land has changed greatly since uh, Renan's basically started mining this these regions for resources. Yeah, silly. to use law when there's a shield that pops up. Shield! Oh. Too late. Looks like they got the spell off too. You don't have to specifically target when it comes to Rinwell. I think she just 
take the spells from everyone. Hmm. Okay, that's good to know. What they call yin yang bomb and tropes. <laughs> I'll hold on to that. Yay, we found a red sage. They can use both physical and magical attacks. And they're skilled with the rapier. <laughs> Oh no, jumping my biggest weakness. Maybe during the break, if uh, it's still during break, after I get up and stretch and get more water, I'll try to go through and set skills for everyone on the uh, second skill set. We need air skills on Kisra at all. Did she start with none? She started with none. Then you'll need more water. I will need. Rest assured, we have reached the top. It's all downhill from here, quite literally. <laughs> so Mahog Sars just up ahead, then? Indeed. If you look across this mountain, is the Lord's Keep. I'll check the map before I climb back up. It's a dead end down this way. Hmm. What's this place here? Some kind of old house? Hmm. I don't know about that. If I had to guess, it probably served as some kind of shrine. So it's still a house, in a sense. Oh. <laughs> Just for a god. Hmm. Oh, we must have learned one. Just didn't have it set. Well, I have Guardian Field on the second set. That's up to you. Oh, <laughs> Hang, I said it's half the speed. I didn't do them. Oh, shit. I still got one of them. Have you been holding uh, guard while using your skills? I feel like I've been for a lot of them. Okay. Just making sure. Bonk. Both of us. Thanks for the hydrate, Jake. Ouch. Can I get a little healing over here? Alas, oh, it is break time. Out at present. Uh, let's see if it. Uh. Yeah. I don't have my alarm set up for today. That's why I didn't. Whoops. Uh, all right. So we will we'll be back in a few minutes to finish exploring this house. Is everything good? The fact that you don't have your alarms today? It's Friday. Why would I have them today? Oh. Alright. Uh, see you. See you in a few. Bye, Palom. Uh, da -da.
Okay. I started to poke through skill stuff. Huh. Xion does have a dark attack. Something she only more recently got, I imagine. Fades left with a sweeping ray of light. That should be interesting to see. It's only been used 11 times. <laughs> and then there's Cyan Instant, which has been used 863 times. Really that many times? It doesn't feel like we've seen it at all. Cyan Instant? Yeah. Cyan Instant. It must be gone in a Cyan Instant. Uh, da, da, da. Glimmer Dragon, Eagle Dive, Eagle Assault. Oops. Death Blossom. And Death Blossom again. Uh, what do we have over here? Serpent Knuckle, Dark Wind, and Tectonic Punch. <laughs> I got... <laughs> oh, during the break, I checked my messages. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> this will actually be good to have set for us specifically steel so we can remember to boost if we are using law hmm thanks for the hydrate jewels all right i'm on set swallow razor placid wow that's two words i shouldn't have followed up with each other what'd you Oh, dear. I was just listening to the first word for each of them to oh. remember when I switched. It's like, swallow, raise. Um, hmm. <laughs> nope. Do nope. not swallow razor. Do nope. Not Do swallow not. Swallow razor. Gusty nail, spread, and photon. Just stuff that hasn't been used much. Well, there's her buff skills. You know it's bad when her two buff skills have only been used twice each? It's closer to something like 15, but 13 of those times were when we floated back from Mantis fights. So the only times they're being used are the Mantis fights? Still slightly an issue. Luna Devastation Rising. Luna Devastation Rising. Uh, double Urchi Plasma. We still don't have the Flaming Edge for Demon Fang. Wow. At this point, I'm kind of just choosing the ones that we've got low usage on. Mega Sonic Thrust. Oh my. Alright, and items. Orange gel use. Thanks, Xion. I was so preoccupied dealing with a Zoogle, I slipped and fell. Make sure you don't make the same mistake as me. Yay, a raging storm beak. Oh, is that finally 12? Oh, nope. But the way. Fade out from them vanishing. 
You just did the hydrate there, right? I did the hydrate at least. I'm pretty sure I I'm pretty sure I did too. Okay. Was that me when I did my little story? Hmm. I don't even know. But basically, I just trolled people by seeing a conversation about Pokemon regions. And I'm like, how about Galar? <laughs> I mean, some people genuinely did enjoy Galar, so. Zegra did love Galar. Learned a glacial fire. Astral energy, huh? A perfect combination. <laughs> yeah, that's particularly specific comment about the uh, battle. Uh, okay. What's up? Never mind. I was thinking that we probably should go back to camp next time we have to restore CP. <clears throat> Just to conserve that. We can buy more. If we're at a camp, we're going to be buying more anyways. Fair. Or able to buy more, at least. Hmm. Stonewing Mantle. Buttons hit now. At least he didn't dodge out of the way when you did that law. That'd have been embarrassing. Timmy just went to bed. He's still using that stupid annoying lord. Stupid sexy annoying like stupidly sexy handsome annoying lord. <laughs> yes. Welcome back. And back to uh, Nexus. We are still him. using Shion. <laughs> I don't find Dovalim annoying. Like, he's actually very reasonable about a lot of things. You have been gushing about how this plot that hammers people over the head is uh, actually enjoyable. It's very <laughs> blunt, but it. Yeah. Hey, look, an orange gem. I mean, just because the plot is blunt doesn't mean it can't be, you know, like you said, enjoyable. Mm -hmm. Also, keep in mind I am very easy to please a lot of the time, so... It's interesting because 
even though these kind of topics are touched on decently much in RPGs, or at least the Japanese fantasy settings for some reason, because you see that in other and he's a guy anime a lot too with Beastman. <laughs> Beastman in general, but he's a guy seem particularly prevalent as a lower class in isekai. Probably part of a power fantasy, just savior complex stuff. Um. So, but like this game feels like it gets more readily political and. Like some like first games, and I say that because it's uh, oh, law does not help with that. Okay, because of some of the ways it says things, you know. Mm -hmm. Just some um, of its arguments kind of seem to be different directions than the innately. Oh wow. Cool. Just um, plus, like the easy answer kind of things, you know? Mm. It's very blunt. That's <laughs> why he was right. It's so blade open. Uh, is everyone getting what I'm saying? Yeah, am I making sense to everyone? Yeah. Crystal. Mm. I guess what I'm saying is that it feels more political because it's easy to just say the obvious things like slavery is bad, but it takes a, it says a lot more of a message than just that easy answer. Like, after becoming free from oppression, uh, yeah, okay. Like, uh, rather than just saying, well, uh, slavery is bad. Talking about the difficulties of recovering from oppression and mentioning the discussion with losing your history due to that kind of oppression. That jerk! It guarded right when that was hitting. <laughs> I'm picking up what you're putting down. <laughs> I'm pretty lucky. And uh, I would argue that's that's one of those uncomfortable messages when people who get used to being oppressed kind of get in the moment where they sit and take it. You know? Mm. I came here looking for food and weapons, but it's nothing but zoogles around here. Not that I have anything to worry about because of you now. Is that finally 12? Are we at 12? We're not at 12. Yeah, internalizing it. I didn't finish eating, okay. so I just kind of got caught up in the conversation. It is around this way I want to go, right? Uh oh, that is actually a transition point, I think. Hmm. I guess we'll see. 
It might be as simple as, oh, hey, we're in a cave now. See, this is why we make a good uh, pairing, though. You're here for all the deep analysis, and I'm here for, ooh, shiny. Not all Cypathos goes deep. Though I guess having someone who works with it. Um, shouldn't we go back and explore the rest of the area? Yara Ridge. Uh, the rest of the area was... Take another transition point, I think. But, yeah. There's a fast travel there to the mountain trail now. So if nothing else... We can always just jump right back up there. Uh, okay, we'll come back. Yeah, we haven't. Yep. Man, I'm famished. Okay. Oh. Happy boop. Uh, go, go, calling it. All it gets to use it. Cool. You get to boop a bit of Kate. She bit off my hand. Well, you shouldn't have called it to boop a bit of Kate then. Who said anything about calling it to boop a bit of Kate? I did. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, it's not gonna work, is it? Still thinking about how to act around Dohalim. Thanks for the boobs. Except I don't think I'll remember this, Jack. After all, don't get me wrong. I'm not going to stay his servant. However, I am going to treat him like a fellow comrade, the same way I would with you or anyone else. For as long as I can remember, I've spent my life protecting others. Aw, thanks, Jules. Isn't that what friends do too? So I did hydrate and oh. Which, in the end, pretty much means doing as you've always done, right? If that's what you're most comfortable with, I'm Let's certainly not going to this. give you any grief Here's over it. Actually, I've been thinking about how I ought to act around you all as well. Oh? When I set out on this journey, it was to rid Eldamen and Sia of its enemies and search for wisdom in the outside world. Wisdom that I could potentially put to use on my return. I'm grateful to you all for letting me tag along. But it got me thinking. What am I actually contributing by being here? What are you talking Tank? about? You know how to hold a weapon, don't you? That's help enough. Is it, though? Sometimes I wish there was more I could be doing to pull my... Oops, uh, sorry about that. Jeez, I'm famished. <laughs> now that you mention it, what do you guys normally do for food and meals when you're out and about on your travels? What do you mean, what do we do? We find stuff to eat and eat it. So long as it's meat, I'm not fussy. Eating what you like can be good for morale in the short term. But you need to think about your diet mm -hmm. if you want to stay healthy. Does that mean eating vegetables too? <laughs> Isn't that obvious? Hmm. It does. Which I guess hasn't been happening up till now. Yeah, to be honest, we could be eating better than we do. I know that feeling. Understood. In that case, I'll just have to make sure you're all staying <laughs> healthy and mom. right myself. Fortunately, I happen to know a thing or two about cooking as well. You hear that? Yay, Kisa can cook like as well. Your greens after all. Uh, what is it? No, sorry, it's just I was just wondering if you had a Thanks, Jack. This. I will do so. It will do her good to have a project. No, not Kisara. I meant you. Was there anything you wanted to add? Me? Certainly you're not looking to me for Oh my god, what could you do to help? <laughs> Typical Renan. Leaving everything to someone else. Rinwell, I don't think... That said, should you need my skills on the battlefield, please rest assured I have no intention of shirking my responsibilities, regardless of who we may face. I'm sure no one doubts that. Listen, guys, if we're traveling together, we should probably at least try to make an effort to get to know one another. I don't think there's don't an echo. Think? That's good. I wouldn't get your expectations too high in that regard. Believe it or not, sometimes I'm not sure I even know myself all that well. Isn't that a mood? 
Yeah, the only reason that we have a good idea of who we are. By the way, thanks for the best buff times, Jack. Boop. Hmm. Do your work. Yeah. She told me to do my worst. It's okay, I still held back. Words. Uh oh. Hey, let's stop for a minute. What's up? You already tired? My armor's pretty heavy. I think I need a little rest. <laughs> I second that. All of this walking is starting to take its toll on me as well. What? You don't look it. We can't spare the time. There's places we need to be. Mahogsar's capital, Niez, is our destination right now. But if one of us collapses, it will only serve to slow us down. And in your case, Alfin is the only one who could carry you. Best to rest while you have the opportunity. I... Enough already! I need a break, so we're taking one. <laughs> <laughs> I don't need you fretting over me. Fretting? Hey, it's not like I'm... It's not like I like you or anything, Babaka. Oh, well, hello there. <clears throat> Good catch. For you. For me, why? <laughs> oh. Because this is when we get Dohalim to slow him down, right? Desire. Then why oh. are we fighting? Hmm? Thanks. Mm -hmm. mm. Yeah, I think it could be comfortable for me. Took a... one hit and you're almost at half health. Welcome to playing law. <laughs> Haven't we surpassed multiple lords at this point? This guy's doing it on his own, man. Doesn't have his fire sword, which is probably canonically the only reason we've been surpassing lords. Hmm, that's fair. We really need to get Dohalim's uh, boost charged. That is... Huh. Oh! Strength against... Son of a fucking... But no, we should have Law in the main party. I love having tissue paper. You noticed everyone's taking so much damage. Yeah, because Xion can't heal them while she's busy trying to resurrect you. He's doubling first. Or boost. Yeah. 
There's nothing. Oh. Oh, and she owns down. Yeah. Uh, I will revive myself so that GM doesn't automatically go for that. Oh! Yo, Liam has a revive too. Yeah. Okay, so I don't have a Zagro. He's just going for our healers. Just Oh, it's just uh, endurance. Yeah, about time Alpha carries his weight in this fight. That's a cool perspective on that, actually. Hey, that's about what happened. He hits you once and you're on the ground. <laughs> oh. He looks like he should be in a. Oh. Looks like he should be in a fighting game with all those combo attacks he's doing. Yeah. You can hit everybody else, but when you go to strike Hoodle, you don't strike down the Hoodle. <laughs> I'll bring you back. I'll bring you back. I'll bring you back from death. I'll bring you back. I'll bring you back from death a bit. <laughs> <laughs> a remix is that all that you've got very well are we about to lose the other part of our mask oh. Actually are. A wretch like you. You're the one who can bring him back from death. Oh. Is that mask? I think that might be Shion, wake up, please. Alfin Shion. Thanks, but you're kinda crushing me. Oh, sorry. It's okay. And so am I. You just got sword through the chest. Don't play it down. Oh. Right, healer. Yeah, as long as she's not dead, I guess. And you can just heal it. I'll bring me back from death's abyss. <laughs> it's not as bad as it looks. Not bad. That's. Shion, we thought I'm you fine. were. fine. Really. What the hell were you thinking? Well, you were trying to protect me too, you know. Yeah, but I have the sword. It's different. It's not different. Besides, I. Hmm? Never mind. It's nothing. Anyway, uh, thank you. But uh, I didn't. <sighs> Look, I'm just glad that you're... Uh? 
Oh, I saw something in that flashback. Alfin? Sorry. I... That guy said he'd be back. I think maybe we should get moving before he returns, right? Rinwell has a good point. We need to go. Shion, are you sure you're okay? Hmm. Clearly has something to do with Alfin's past, sure though. With okay? the way the mask reacted like that as well. Yeah, I already applied some healing arts to it. It didn't <clears throat> even leave a scar. But his sword went nearly straight through you. I'm all right. Unless I've turned into some kind of ghost and I'm haunting you all right now. <laughs> she can make jokes. No, I, no, you're not. It's just... <clears throat> Look, I appreciate you looking out for me. But I'm fine. Really. There was also that strange light that appeared when Xion was stabbed. It seemed to make the enemy retreat when he saw it. Alfin, do you have she has three cores in her right now. A light? Are they I in her? Know. No, are they just I was on their possession. With other or in their possession. Time. Hmm. Now that I think of it, between that light and the blazing sword, just what sort of person are you, Alfin? Can you use Dan and astral arts like Rinwell, perhaps? He wouldn't know, Dohalim. He doesn't have any memories from his past, remember? Besides, we should really be getting out of here. I suppose you're right. Forgive me. We've almost reached Nias, the capital of Mahagsar. Mm. With any luck, we'll find a place there for Xion to rest. <sighs> hey. Mm. Hmm. Oh. Something wrong? You look like you're deep in thought. Not exactly. I was merely thinking about you two and your sense of etiquette. Oh, no. oh? Etiquette? Indeed. Can to be quite frank, oh. I find your lack of manners to be nigh intolerable. <laughs> that's not being frank, that's being an... an... Forget it! Do we really need to talk about this now? Yes. I find such impropriety on your parts to be deeply unsettling. It concerns <sighs> me Dolly, greatly. I was just being nice to you what earlier. to do? We were slaves. We never got to learn how to be proper like you. Yeah, what he said. Maybe you missed how we were just focused on surviving. Perhaps, but Kisara here demonstrates that it's quite possible for a Denon to learn proper manners. That's because I was given the opportunity to learn. Moreover, my duties as a guardsman required it. Not every realm is like Menencia, as you well know. Yeah, I don't think it's fair to hold us to some other city standards. Exactly! You've got to remember what it's been like for us living under the Rena elsewhere. Hmm. I will concede that you do indeed make a valid point. It would appear, for all my espousing the virtues of equality between our peoples, I was still looking down on the two of you. You don't need to beat yourself up. I wasn't that offended by what you said, man. He just has that uh, uh, recovery so skill automatically, on doesn't he? <laughs> Having said that, I do believe you two would still benefit from learning the basics of proper society. I would be more than happy to teach you both when we camp out, if you like. <laughs> yeah, no, I'll pass. Acting all prim and proper isn't really my style. If you say so, how about you, Law? Would you like to learn? Although I suppose my first task is to reform your attitude toward the idea of good etiquette. You're not going to let this go, are you? <laughs> How are you holding up after that last fight? You're not too hurt, are you? I'm fine, really. See for yourself. If things get too tough out there, go ahead and fall back. I can take a beating if I need to. I'm not here just to stand around and have everyone protect me. I get that, but there's nothing wrong with admitting you have You're the healer too. and arranged attacker. Yeah, Stay like in the back. Put on a brave face to you. Uh, <laughs> I can't feel pain, but you still can. Can't you? <sighs> look, I appreciate you're trying to look out for me, but even you go down in fights from time to time. Please, stop trying to babysit me. It's getting old. It's not that. I just... Hmm.
become so numb. That doesn't sound good. You looking for something? Yep. I won't know until I find it. Hmm. Oh. Rico got stabbed in his chest home. You should look for yourself. <laughs> yeah. Hey, fast travel point was added. Hmm. But I... What's up? Hmm. What? Nothing. Just... Getting lost. Yeah, that sounds about right. <laughs> yes, it's not looking good. Are we in the right place? This place looks like a mess. Looks fine. Yes, this is Niaz. The capital of Mahag Sar. I don't see any signs of people. And the buildings. Yeah. This doesn't seem like the kind of place people would actually live. No soldiers, no Danans, not a soul to be seen. Yet look at these facades. This is clearly a Renan district. Hey, check out that drawing on the castle gate. That's the Darkwing's crest. Like the ducks? It's from an old Danon legend about a hero who defeated an evil king with a torch and their trusty owl. That's his crest. I'm sure of it. Darkwing really? Duck. First time Let's I'm here. Get dangerous. So if someone drew it on the gate. <laughs> it must mean the Renans have lost control of the city. Are you suggesting the Danons rose up and defeated the Lord here? Hard to believe, but not entirely unthinkable given the evidence. Given the evidence of let's look around and see if we can find someone. This group. They might be able to tell us what happened. <sighs> this group has a fire sword. What if the other group has a fire sword? This is horrible. Is there truly no one here? All of these ruins look like they were made pretty recently. But if that's the case, just then like where Jackson. Do you think the people that used to live here went off to? There must have been Danans and Renans, right? That's a good question. Even if the Danans rebelled and managed to overthrow the Renans here, there should still be some people around. This debris? Do you think it could be the work of Renan Astral Arts? Perhaps, but the appearance of these ruins is rather uniform, which leads me to believe otherwise. Hey, Rinwell. That story you told us about the Dark Wings. It said that the evil king was vanquished with a holy flame, right? Holy duck. Yeah, that's right. Then there might be some truth to that old story after all. <laughs> it looks like all the rubble here had been scarred by flames. Let's not jump to any conclusions just yet. If we can find someone around here, I mean, it could just be, be people replicating the story. Hmm. Raising Delaline. You forgot to take care of the fire yesterday. What do you mean, take care of? Ah, yes. You meant to put it out? Yep. If it stays lit, we could end up in real trouble real fast. I see. I apologize for not realizing that. I shall be more careful in the future. The way he's talking, it's like the thought of putting it out himself never even occurred to him. Moving on, Dohalim, I should mention that the clasp for your cape is about to come undone. <laughs> oh, yes. I tried to fix that myself, but it simply refused to cooperate with me. I can't believe I'm hearing this. Are you telling me Renans can't even dress themselves? Lords like Dohalim have attendants to take care of well. just about everything they need. So I'm not surprised he sometimes struggles with the basics. Even by those standards, you've got to admit, this is still a little extreme. <laughs> Shion has got a point. I mean, you don't see Renans like her needing so much help to get stuff She's done. She's a very self-made man. In my case, circumstances forced me to learn how to be independent. Even so, I still think Dohalim could afford He's to take useless. up a few more self He's useful in a battle. Hmm. 
Well, specifically speaking, what would you suggest that I learn? For starters, I think it'd be good for you to learn how to dress and put on shoes. How to comb your hair is <laughs> equally important. Team mom. And learning to manage your possessions better. And then from there... She sounds like his mom rattling all that off. <laughs> Team mom. Oh, and another thing. About your owl, Rinwell. What? What is it? When he starts to molt, would you be willing to give me his old feathers? I think I could find a use for them. What do you intend to do with those? Well, recently, I haven't been sleeping well. However, I hear pillows made from uh. feathers are very comfortable and wish to make one. Uh. This is why I hate you, Renans! Did I say something offensive? Next time, put your own needs aside for a second and think about how someone might react first. Then consider if it's worth asking at all. I don't know if anyone wanted to use my feathers. First, I'd ask the, where they found any feathers for me. But after that, I would be very thankful that someone found a use for them. I'm not going to lie. That one is actually a reasonable-ish. Like, a reasonable-ish request. You and I think more pragmatically. Yeah. But it's not like it's like, hey, rip your house feathers out for me. It's just... Then when they molt, could could I have the feathers? Please. Uh, those are called down feathers, are they? Yeah. I mean, this isn't a matter of whether it's the right kind of feathers or not. It's like the idea of. Hmm. Are likely the outer layers? Yeah. Oh, <laughs> everyone's teaming up on Renwell. <laughs> Specifically, say who wanted the ones that fall out. Yeah. Like, that particular instance, I don't think there was anything wrong. Can I have your wares? <laughs> Owls have wear if you have coin. <laughs> Maybe something's going on in the forest. Oh, hey, I think we get another reward at the uh, Owl Sanctuary. This is probably the exit to the next realm. Uh, it's locked. Yeah, that's the only reason I try to go through the door. <laughs> so, yeah. I don't think that is the exit to the next realm, because if you look at the map, looks like it's just another entrance to that center area there. True. What are those out in the valley? Windmills? They're huge. They're most likely used to harvest wind astral energy, so they have to be big. Features in these realms are very exaggerated. The ice realm was a endless winter night. The parts of a fire realm was literally on fire. The overgrowth was naturally huge in the grass realm. And now here you have huge windmill turbines just to keep up with the wind. All of you stop right there. Don't move. Uh oh. Are we in trouble? They have us surrounded. Who are you? Where did you come from? You first. Show yourself. I'm the one asking the questions here. Don't try anything funny. One wrong move, and I guarantee we'll blow you away. Whoa! What are you try your best. My name is Alfin. I came here from Calaglia. Alfin? The wielder of the blazing sword? Getting pretty famous, isn't he? <laughs> <clears throat> Here is my proof. Will that suffice? Or do I have to burn down one of those houses to make my point? 
No need. I believe you. <laughs> yeah. I'm Bayfong of the Dark Wings. Sorry for threatening to blow you away. We're still hunting down the remnants of the enemy forces. So everyone's more than a bit on edge right now. I still Please appreciate the touch of his gauntlet, like, Remaining. burning still. Wait, you mean you already took down the lord of this realm? That's right. We took her weapons and turned them right back on her. Are you the Danon leader here in Niez? Nah, I'm just one of the commanders. Deadheim's the one who runs the show. I'd be happy to take you to him. Just one problem. Those two. The yeah. Renans. Seems the rumors you were running with them were true. You do understand, right? I mean, we only just liberated the city from their kind. Everyone's short on trust. And for good reason. Especially Deadeye. I think it'd be best if those two waited outside. Not going to happen. I don't think it's a good idea for us to split up. It's too dangerous. Aw, Redmall does care about them. <sighs> then it's on your head, friend. Our base is that way. You could have left me behind, you know. Not really. You can't take care of yourself. You, <laughs> uh, yes. <laughs> uh, he's struggling. Your work's only really just begun, huh? Yeah. This place seems like it's got a lot of issues to fix. So. They're just using the realms for numerous angles on the issue. Yeah, and here is the aerial plaza that leads to Almadre, uh, Almadrea's castle. But for now, it's sealed off, so I'll have to ask you to turn away. So between disappearing into the air, the move went like movements and everything. I thought that Cloak's figure this. was a lord, but first of all, the lord is a she here. And second of all, yeah. it's a door. Just say the door is locked. Don't think too much about it. Not like. Don't think too much about no, it. No, no, no. They have plenty of randomly locked doors. You say the door is locked, fine. You're we thinking just, too much. We just come back later. Why do they need an invisible wall right here? I'm just thinking about it from a design standpoint. Like. Not trying to push, you know, ooh, lore, blah, blah, blah. Like, just say the door's locked. They could have had unexpected bugs break out in that area. I think mean, sometimes programming just doesn't work with you and it seems practically mythical. But For example, uh, like, there could be some kind of loading zone glitch that kept on happening. And they just mitigated it by... Not even worrying about it. But on that note, it is time for our next break. <laughs> oh my goodness, a magic wall. Maybe they have a Mr. Mime. But yes, we'll be also, back. Also, before we go, it's possible that instead of it being locked, that it was like, oh, we have no direction. We better go to the Lord. And when they translate it, they say, it's, like, it's locked. That would make sense for... For the reason that it's set up like that, right? Eh. No. Really? They could just translate it to, hey, we should be going to the Lord. Well, I mean, yeah, obviously. But does it mean that they will? But we will be back in a few minutes. Hope you all enjoyed having where a about. And we'll be back with Terry. Where a say ya. Uh, it's a very uh, easy name to pronounce. Uh, rah, 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 rah. You see a little leaf <laughs> and you're panicking. <laughs> Alright, see you, Jack. See you in a few.
And it's time we get on with the final stretch of the stream. Ooh, shiny. They got chicken. Chicken? Chicken. 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 These are the headquarters of the Darkwing Chickens. Right now, these are temporary accommodations. At some point, I imagine we'll build something better and move into that. Let's check it out. Oh. oh, did you have to do that loading screen? So you're Elfin, are ya? Thought you'd be bigger. Huh. Guess the armor beefs you up a bit. You've got a lot of people talking, you know. But in this town, I call the shots. You play by my rules here. Just remember that. Gotta say, I didn't expect you to run with a gang of women and kids. Those other lords must have been real pushovers, huh? Seriously? This kind of guy? Just rude to everyone you meet? Oh, great. Don't interrupt me, you brat. Didn't your parents teach you any manners? Why you? So you're the one who took down the lord of this realm, huh? How'd you pull that off? <laughs> we just swiped the Renan's explosives, and then we blasted them all to hell and back. Explosives? That's a pretty bold approach. But how'd you manage to avoid hurting your own people? Aviad. That's how. How did you manage to Aviad? Was worth the sacrifice. And the lord? What did this sacrifice earn you? Unfortunately, we couldn't manage to finish her off. But now we've really got the girl on the run. She ran? A lord? Yeah, the lady was just a coward. She had a whole lot more bark than bite, that's for sure. She's probably hiding off in a hole somewhere. But not for long. We'll find her and drag her right back into town. Then she'll get what's coming to her. I wouldn't be so sure. She may run, but she'll never go quiet. Shut up, Bright Eyes! I would have run you through already if you weren't with the Blazing Sword here. The whole reason you're fighting is to free the Danans in this realm, is it not? If Shut so, your then... mouth, witch! That's enough! If you're really fighting for us Danans, why keep these bastards around? Why haven't you killed them already? I'm not going to kill these bastards. Oh. Is that the case, huh? Tell me the point of this show. They're my friends. <sighs> friends? Renans are Renans. They're the scum sucking bastards who've been draining our souls for three years. I know it's the point, but I now. really don't like this guy. Eliminate target. <laughs> Son of a you'll pay for that. That's enough. Dead on. You know that was completely uncalled for. Hmm. All of you get the hell out of my realm. And don't ever come back. This is Tannin's realm and it's ours, understand? I call the shots here. And I make the rules. I do, Deadheim! Leader of the Dark Way! Yeah! Deadheim! Liberator Deadheim! You are the true leader of this realm! We're not afraid of any bright eye! It's only a matter of time before I throw every last bright eye out of this realm! The Dark Wing! The Dark Wing's rule! That was satisfying. Thank you, Alfin. Mm hmm Hey, wait up. Told you so, didn't I? You should have left your Renan pals outside. You don't agree with him, do you? I could tell by the look on your face in there. That's how things are with him. He loses his temper, then I step in and calm things down. Better you than me. 
<laughs> if that's all, I think it's past time we were going. Look, I just wanted to apologize for what Deadheim said in there. <laughs> At least somebody's got some manners around here. And it's not you, Law. It didn't used to be like that. But, well, that's what losing most of your loved ones will do to him. How many loved ones did he make, he please? never forgive the Renants. It's a little ironic how indistinguishable his manner is to that of a lord. <sighs> hey, Bayfon. Damn. Dead I mentioned the lord is still on the run. Any ideas where she might be? We looked all over, but found no traces of her. We heard some rumblings about activity in Esteluva Forest, but that's it. Esteluva, huh? Wait, you're not going after her, are you? Certainly won't win you any favors with Deadheim. This isn't Deadheim's war, and we're certainly not fighting it for him. Besides, it's like Shion said, her type isn't going to go quietly. Hey, it's your funeral. Don't say I didn't warn you. We'll be sure to keep you out of it. Before we set out, though, is there anywhere around here we can rest? Sure. Building at the end of the road, opposite side. It's all yours. We use it as temporary lodging, to house people who don't have a new place to live quite yet. We're not going to run into any trouble there, are we? Rumors of a certain fiery sword have spread fast. I doubt anyone will be eager to give you guys problems. <laughs> and here's where I say my farewell. You're on your own, but good hunting. Before you go, how come you don't hate the Renins as well? Oh, believe me. I've got my bone to pick with the Renans. Just not with two of them I've never so much as laid eyes on before. Uh. Yes, Renmal. Look, someone reasonable about their watch. hatred. We'll figure out what our next move is there. Seen appear to be suffocating on her. Lace it just thick. I get the feeling dead I'm signed up to be a rebel so he could have a rooster rule. Heck, he's no better than a lord. In some ways, he's even worse. I know. How could he use explosives on his that. own people? Yeah. And yet, despite the toll of his actions, none of the Danans we've seen seem to question his assumed authority in the least. If anything, they may well consider him a hero. Which would say a great deal toward how deeply they resented the Renans here. Still, I don't think this is as simple as saying the good guys won out over the bad ones. Yeah, I don't either. Deadeye might have managed to drive the Renans out of Niaz, but that doesn't make the way he did it okay. No matter which way you look at it. A victory that's earned by throwing away the lives of his own people? No, that isn't a victory at all. I can understand that the Danans here are standing up against their oppression, but that doesn't mean they have to humiliate all Renans just to settle the score. I'm perfectly able to stand up for myself, Alfin. Besides, I'm used to it by... But you shouldn't have to be, Shion. That's just... What I mean to say is, when you've been a slave for so long, it's easy to accept that's how it should be because it's all you've ever known. Constantly being belittled is no different. I don't think that's fair. For me or for you. Uh. Hmm. I just don't know, man. Don't know what? Did I manage to drive out a real live Renan Lord? That's incredible. And he seems to have a lot of supporters surrounding him, too. Lots of explosives. But he's got an attitude worse than any angry Zoogle. Plus, Niaz is in utter ruins. I don't have a clue what his game is. The Renans are powerful. And because of that, it takes a strong leader to have any hope of toppling them. However, when you take down one dictator only to replace them with another, ultimately it's just business as usual. If it had been Zephyr instead of Deadheim, I don't think things would have turned out like this. Rinwell! Yeah, I think so too. Zephyr did things differently top to bottom. Mm. He's not the kind of person who would have forced his own views or decisions on other people. When you do that, no, but not pretty. Ruling over oh, good. Others, not Quite the opposite. Mm -hmm. To be honest, he's pretty good at convincing others to go to with him, though. Was in that position. Law. The whole thing feels weird in a way. It's a weird kind of feeling. 
but at the same time, it feels weird. Me also weird feels feeling. Happy? Feeling of Jedi weirdness. Jedi and my dad are two very different men. For now, I'm content knowing that. The city is liberated, and yet the air still hums with fear and anxiety. It reminds me all too well of how Vicent once was. Hums? You mean like music? Yeah, none of this sounds like music to my ears. In fact, I've never seen any Danans with musical instruments in my life. You don't need instruments to play music. It can emerge naturally from the sounds of people going about their day and the hustle and bustle of life. You seem to care a lot about music, Dohalim. I didn't know that about you. Have I not mentioned it? Before I was a candidate for the Lordship, I had my heart set on the life of a musician. Heart. You? A musician? Mm. Indeed. Music enriches the world around us. I trained day and night to hone my art. Words could not describe my bliss as my notes carried with them the sights and sounds of nature, the ebb and flow of time, and the thoughts of people on the wind. <clears throat> Dohalim. Forgive me. My loquaciousness can get the best of me at times. Don't apologize. It's interesting hearing what Renan culture is like. <laughs> Even though the Renans destroyed all of our arts and culture. Personally, I was interested in the music of Dana as well. The fact that generations of lords deemed music to be of no use to their slaves and outright forbade the ownership of instruments is lamentable. Not that my words can undo the damage already done. Hey, Quest. Uh, Dolan hmm. could be good at helping Dan and setting back up after liberations if we played that again. Ah, they could be. Uh, why does everybody have to be such cowards? If we don't get this taken care of, things are never going to change. Let's got you down, friend. <sighs> Zoogles, that's what. A pretty common variety of them, to be more specific. Rumors say it was the Lord's favorite kind of Zoogle, so people are afraid to go anywhere near right. them. I can understand their hesitation. If you need them gone, we're more than capable of taking care of them for you. Hold on, pal. I don't want you to just exterminate them. If you could bring back any usable materials from them, that'd be great, too. Mm -hmm. You want us to retrieve Zoogle parts? For what? Are you building something? Not building. Studying. If I can demonstrate that even fearsome, dangerous Zoogles can be used to make handy tools, that'll motivate people to hunt them more. Mm. We can't always expect folks like you to come along and solve all our problems for us, after all. <gasps> so you're trying to be more self-sufficient. It's very commendable of hey. you. Actually, about those materials you're looking for, this isn't what you're talking about, is it? Yeah. Oh yeah, it totally is. Could I convince you to share what you have with me? Good. Yeah, go ahead and help yourself. I'd rather it go to someone who can use it than it keep weighing us down. Great. You're one generous bunch of people. You know that? Now to see just what I can turn all of this into. All right. I'm sure I'll be able to make something useful. Thank you so much. Huh. Hey, roasted chicken recipe. Hmm. Dead Eye's getting kind of scary. Seems like he'll practically stop at nothing to win. Imagine. I agree. His temper seems to be a lot worse than he used to be. But what can you expect? Fighting the Bright Eyes takes its toll on people. Yeah, we're fighting. Or when you become Pyromaniac. Uh, progression-wise... Uh, go ahead and go to the end. But, uh, would you mind if we came back and did these side quests after getting the thing I'm looking forward to? However. Huh? When that, oh, uh, yeah. When what little I had burned down with my home, I thought we were going to die on the streets. That's why I'm grateful we're able to stay here. It really saved our lives. That's what, that's what make the Darkwing such good people. When I grow up, I'm going to join them, too. I think someone's calling out for us. They could have something they need from us. Don't you think Dead Eye's changed recently? What? 
You mean aside from the fact he's a big hotshot now? You know without him, there's no way we would have ever kicked the Renans out. I get that, but he's really different now compared to how he used to be. Uh, do we want to restock on orange gel? Sure. We have to stay alert. Can't let our guard down until we finally capture Almadria. Almadria? Those Renan stooges ran with their tails between their legs. Once Almadria is out of the picture, the age of the bright eyes will finally be over. Have you gone up past Akfotal Hills before? You should. There are great fishing spots to find in both the lakes and ruins. We lost our home. Everything's gone. I know, but that's what happens when you choose to fight the Rena. Fight the Rena, not the Renan. Okay. But it's not all bad, honey. We live to see the day we won. That's worth celebrating, isn't it? There are people resting upstairs who have lost their home, so try to keep it down while you're here. Everything we sell, we source ourselves. You won't find any funny business here. Ooh, lemon gel. What's lemon gel? 2,000 to one ally. Huh. Eh. Well, money. Mm-hmm. Did life bottles get refunded? Uh, we found a couple. We never... Oh, no. Uh, there were some used, weren't there? Mm -hmm. In the, uh, one boss battle. Yes. Hey, look, we have money again. Armor. Yeah, if you want. Uh, did we want to finish stocking up on did uh, consumables? We really just spend that much money? Yes. One moment. <laughs> What's up? That. Oh, you bought without equipping. No, one already in stock. Oh. Nice gun. <laughs> uh, any ingredients? Mm. Nope. Okay. Mm. You good? Mm -hmm. Alright. Are you THE Blazing Sword of Calaglia? You're welcome to stay here if you like, but just don't cause any trouble while you're here, understand? Everything on fire. That dead I'm creep certainly has a few screws loose, that's for sure. Only a few? Forget that guy. Right now, we need to discuss mm. how we're going to proceed. What's there to discuss? Dead Eye and his crew have already brought down the Lord here. Just let them finish her off. I want to go after her. I second that. I think it's the best thing to do right now. Wait, you agree with Xion? We don't know if the have what it takes to beat her. I'm worried what'll happen if we leave her to her own devices. You make a good point, Rinwell. And maybe I'm just being overconfident, but between us and them, I think we have a better chance at defeating her. And without blowing up half continent. This realm is <laughs> going to be truly safe as long as that lord is still running around out there. We need to act. Fine by me. But isn't Dead I'm just gonna take all the credit once we're done? Our job is to break down the walls that oppress Dana. What he chooses to build in their place, that's his problem. <sighs> we'll head to this Estaluva forest Bayfon told us about. Whatever we decide to do, though, we should take some time to rest first. We've barely stopped since Men and Sia. That's an iffy stance to take in its own right.
can't dictate other sub freedoms. Yeah. But if he doesn't care about, you know, oppression, if it's just uh, Danon's oppressing Danon's, then... Where are you going? Iffy. Alfin. You should get some rest. What's got you up at this hour? Just let me be for a minute, okay? Why don't you go back to the inn? I will when you do. <sighs> now kiss. Kiss, kiss, kiss. Have it your kiss, way. Kiss. Shion. The Lord's days are numbered. I haven't forgotten our promise. You can trust me, you know. Maybe even lean on me a little. If you want. And if I say I will, will you finally give it a rest? <laughs> yeah, of course. Try to get some rest, okay? What was all that about? It wasn't just lip service when he says he considers you all his friends. It's almost like he enjoys spending time with you all. So we're just going to check things out, right? In whatever that forest is called. Esteluva Forest. Next time, pay attention. Hmm. Uh, which exit? Probably the one with the invisible wall. Because, you know, can't have things locked or anything. Oh, there's two leaps to castle. Hey, look, I can approach it now. Oh, loading screen. Smartness? Hmm. Valley of the Four Winds, Mahagsar. Mahogany. Deer. Deer. Ah, sand in my eyes. The winds are strong here. Mind yourselves. Ugh, even the inside of my mouth is all sandy. Hoodle, don't get blown away, okay? Oh. Event. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I mean, the winds outside the capital are blowing as strongly as ever. You can definitely see why people call this place the Valley of the Four Winds. Well, no, there's Indeed. only one wind. Mahog Sar is the realm of wind, just as Ganeth Heros is for water. Earth, water, fire, wind, light, and darkness. Rena is aligned to darkness, leaving each realm one element each. Is that because some elements are easier to gather in certain areas than others? That is certainly possible. But I suspect the biggest reason is to prevent the lords from squabbling over resources. Funny. You would think infighting would come naturally to an elite class vying for a crown. True, but the Renans rule as a minority. Fighting ourselves would just be destructive. Though, as you saw in Menencia, any abstention from fighting is merely a facade. In the end, you all get usurped whether you like it or not. Hmm. That may be true. But something tells me that this time is different. We have to catch up to the Lord first if we want answers. Let's keep moving. Mm. Rock formation. Yep. What is that ring of rocks over there for? Mm. They don't look like they formed naturally to me. Oh, yeah. Funny. I guess I've gotten used to weird rock formations. They didn't even register as being out of the ordinary. Most likely, they were brought over by us Renans when we first invaded the planet. Wait, those? So does that mean there's some kind of machine then? And if so, what in the world were they even used for? That's a good question. To manipulate the properties of Dana's astral energy. Really? Think about it. Isn't it strange that the type of energy each realm collects is so fixed? Astral energy by nature isn't meant to skew towards one element or another so heavily. So the Renans reformed it for the crown contest. Sounds like the crazy thing a Renan would do. Renans these days are more advanced than Danans in some ways, 
but even they don't seem capable of doing something on that grand a scale. Or is that something that's possible on Lenegas? Or maybe the Renin homeworld? I can't claim to know everything about my own kind, but I myself have never seen anything that would be capable of such a drastic feat. But at some point, they did just that. Those are the sort of people we're up against. We should do our best not to forget that. Great pose. Hmm. <laughs> And then so amazing, there's Sisara. another one. You can cook, you can fix weapons. I feel like there's practically nothing you can't do. Maybe you should take a page out of her book and learn to make yourself more useful then. Hm. Oh. I'd be happy to teach you if you want, Rinwell. I learned most everything I know from my brother. Really? Even how to sew and do laundry? Yes, indeed. He knew how to do anything. Sounds like he was a pretty handy guy when he was alive. He was. <laughs> I'd always follow him around and badger him with questions. I was a real pain in the neck. Now that I think about it, he and Lagiel were the ones who taught me how to raise cats, too. Lagiel is that woman who was with him in the gold dust cats, right? I remember now. The one with the really pretty hair. Funny you mention that. He also taught me how to maintain my hair. Not that those lessons stopped it from getting all tangled up during training. <laughs> I think it still looks gorgeous. From what I can tell, it would appear as though the only thing he didn't manage to teach you was how to apply makeup. No, but that didn't stop him from trying. He really wanted to teach me everything. Only reason he couldn't was because I prioritized my training. And here I was trying to make a joke. <laughs> I can't tell if she's being serious. The only one here who knows him well enough was her. Yeah, I guess only Miguel could have told us if it's actually true. It wouldn't surprise me if it was. Oh, what? No more scenes? Skip frenzy. <sighs> oh, it's this guy. Didn't oh. realize? Ugh. I did pay that much attention to who was on the ground. Oh, it's that foodie again. Yes. I remember you. You're that young woman who's always starving. I haven't seen you since we last met in Elda Menencia. <sighs> You're the one who's always hungry. Anyway, I take it you found another recipe on your travels? Very nice. I most certainly did. I'm glad I can cut to the chase then. Is that so? Shion, who might this fellow be? This is Gordeno. He travels around Dana in search of new recipes say. to try. A fine quest to embark on, if I do say so myself. My name is Dohalim, kind sir. It is a pleasure to make your acquaintance. Oh. Wow. The Do. The Dohalim? Lord of Elda Manancia? It's an honor, my lord. Your beef stew was absolutely exquisite. I see. You honor me, kind sir. However, how is it that you came by the palace's top secret dish? <laughs> so Samuel turned TV off while Spinishman brushed teeth. Chingo teens with him. <laughs> hey, at least he spent time with them. You know, kind of hard to be upset about you missing the stream for something like that. Hmm. Keeping an eye on you, though, Jack. Four of them. Anyway, what is it you need from us this time exactly? A hundred ten of them. Come on, spit it out. R right. This time I'm looking for lettuce, apples, and lemons. Could I ask you to bring those to me? We have sure. what you need. If that's all you're looking for, we've got it right here. Nice work. In that case, I'll give you the recipe so you find people who can cook it right away. Oh? Wow, this looks surprisingly simple. Even I might have a chance with this. Very nice. Wonderful. I'll leave the preparation up to you then. Salad. Lettuce, apple, and lemon. Salad. Yeah. Wow. Okay, yes. it's all done. Oh, oh, look at that beautiful dish. It smells just as divine, too. Now to see how it tastes. What? Oh, this, this is absolutely exquisite. Exquisitely bad, that is. What? Really? I assure you that I followed the recipe for this so-called vitamin smoothie to the letter. Taste it for yourself and then tell me if you're still confident in your concoction. Here. All right, down the hatch it goes. I don't believe this. See what I mean? Makes you want to vomit, doesn't it? All right. Wait a second. I see a small warning affixed to the bottom of this recipe. Smoothies made entirely from veggies are recommended for experienced dieters only. Beginners should add fruit juice for flavor. No. Young Miss, did you process only the lettuce? 
Even though I asked you to prepare apples and lemons as well. Sure. Oh, come on. Who's going to notice a stupid warning label that tiny? Really now. Lesson learned, Xion. We'll just have to add fruit and attempt this once more. Yes. Very well. Let's take it from the top. What? Whoa. This, this is absolutely exquisite. Comparatively speaking, at least. What? You still don't sound all that enthused. Is this really the best recipe that Mahag Sar has to offer? Hmm. I believe so. When I first heard about this, it made me think of what I saw in Minancia. That combination of fruits and vegetables, it reminded me of Danans and Renans living together. I thought this recipe might capture such harmony. Very nice. If nothing else, it's the most healthy recipe you're sure to find out here. Mm. Indeed. I shall be sure to drink it so as that. So as to ensure that precious harmony lives on, even within the confines of my stomach. Yes. Woo. Well, that was satisfying enough for the time being. I can now leave this realm with no regrets. <laughs> it's time I leave in search of even greater cuisines. Farewell, my culinary comrades. Actually, one more glass before I leave. Huh. OBS, please stop breaking. Let him down. To bring well, that him up. was a huge miscalculation. <laughs> Yet you've drained your glass all the same. Alfin, have you been washing your clothes? It may not be my place to say this, but frankly, they're starting to stink. <laughs> now that you mention it, it has been a while since I did any laundry. I'll wash them for you if you want. Just remember to give them to me the next time you get changed. Oh, okay. Sure. Thanks, Kisara. And... Law, Rinwell, yours are starting to look a bit ragged. Hmm. What do you expect? Of course they're going to tear up when we're out there fighting so much. Yeah, but it's still kind of embarrassing having team it pointed mom. out like this. Kisara makes for great team mom. I wouldn't touch me if I were you. Of course, my apologies. All I wanted to say was that your sleeves are getting a little bit dirty. You don't need to worry so much, Kisara. It's only natural our clothes are going to get a little dirty while we're traveling around. That's no excuse. Your outward appearance says a lot about your inner well-being. Now you've really set her off. <laughs> Suffice to say, it would appear that the traditions of the guard are still alive and well within her. What do you mean? What do the guardsmen do that's so special? Mostly, I'm simply referring to the fact that they're a very regimented and cleanly group of people. Do I really sound that weird to you guys? Keeping your clothes clean and mended is completely normal to me. Don't get us wrong. We appreciate the thought, Kisara. But we've got a long journey ahead. It wouldn't hurt to relax your standards just a little. If you're sure. I wasn't trying to overdo it, I promise. However, if it's making the rest of you tense, I'll do my best to tone it down from here on out. Still, <laughs> if everyone could bring their laundry and clothes they want fixed, that'd be great. I'll take care of it all for you guys tonight. Don't you ever get tired? <laughs> I... Hmm. Hmm? Guards fight with dusters because not enough criminals. <laughs> uh... Give me... Shiga thing. Okay. Okay. Oh, encounter. You look cute. Destroy. Nah, I want to leave them alone. They're wolfos. Seagulls. Yeah, but they're wolfos. Somehow. Things are even worse outside the city than they are inside. Yeah, it's all ruined. Houses hmm? and everything oh. else. Even if it was all eh, in the name of beating the Renants. This is... Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Retro sunglasses. Maybe something's going on in the forest. They were cute feather doggos. Yay, feather doggos. I think Hoodle senses 
something. Huh. Oh, that's just a camp. The way it seemed up. So... Right there next to the water. Okay. This is the eventual goal before we end the stream. Turn around. What? Hmm. What's up? Oh, reaction. Just that there's something in this area. Hmm. Huh. Enemies. Why do the Renans take advantage of all of these ruins around here? It seems like a missed opportunity. Most likely because it would be inefficient for harvesting astral energy. That's what dictates the current positions of each realm's capital. Plus, Renans are averse to using anything that belonged to the Danans. You mean like the Danans' lives? Man. <sighs> Crystals. A dull moment on this journey. Here we go. Got the crystals for you. Am I imagining things? Or are there a lot of big zoogles in this area? No, I noticed that too. There's plenty of food and water to go around here. For a zoogle, this just might be paradise. Great! Right, that's exactly what I wanted to hear. <laughs> Hi, Drake. Oh, thanks for the hi, Drake. One impressive hunting murder dog goes, Terry's just on thin ice. Okay, so just stay along the side of the wall. I'll come back for the bird, I promise. Bird is also an enemy. Target. Yep. You want to have a go? Mm hmm. That enemy looks strong. I bet it'll be worth our while to fight it. Don't think we can get to the chest without doing so. Hmm. Mm -hmm. If you can, though, chest would be good. Say we should switch law out. Sure. Yay, someone who's not a wet Don't tissue. Wet tissue. Often in Kisa are lowish health. Oh, okay. Right, Dolin can heal. Uh, what element was it? Oh, weak to fire. Maybe. Was it a water? Just getting off wind. It's what? Just getting off wind. Ah. I mean, if you target it, can't you see its element? Then tonight's meal is on you. Now, what to make? It's time to finish this. Die! Consuming wildfire. Earth. Okay, so. Wait, was weak uh, being resisted? Or wind being resisted? We'll try wind. She owns down now. Yourself. <laughs> that instant life model. Hmm. 
If you're going to be going through this minute healing, might want to go ahead and use uh, an orange gel. A bit preemptively. It is resisting it. Huh. Mm -hmm. Oh. Oh no, then weakness. What? Another party member. Yeah. Uh, Alfin's boost attack to down it. Boom. Alfin's ready for downing again. Yeah, you probably shouldn't just let it stand there behind you like that. Late reaction. Alphans down. Oh, Alphans back up. Doilim got him up. Brinwell, Brinwell. Oh, too late. Hmm. Oh, thanks for the hydrate tools. Too late. You don't have enough CP for it. is almost dead. Drop open some. Besides, don't they still get experience? Yes. 
eliminated. Good to know my training is paying off. Tempest Zone and Lizard Fin. Blade of Ceiling. There's history in the air here. I can smell it. That is a relic. Artifact. Anything. Whatever. Not one we want to activate right now. Reduces all damage, both taken and inflicted, to just one. Don't encourage him. Combo grind. Uh, art proficiency grind. An SIN instant. <laughs> but you get both the arts used up and the proficiency up mm. with that, which means Austrian grinding can actually, you know. Go at a decent rate instead of having to just end battles, find new battles, repeat. Mm. Did you uh, do the hydrakes? Oh, well, yeah. First. <laughs> Did you heal? Yeah. Interference. Well, it's a good thing Dohalim has uh, healing covered. A blip on our radar. <laughs> Grr, bark, bark. Man, imagine being thirty. So young. Thirty. Thirty. Practically a newborn. Grumpy, grumpy noises. Had to take Samuel back to bed. He wanted something he forgot to take to his bedroom. That's why he was too late. Oh. I can see that he can watch some of the stream tomorrow, so please say it's not Saren's turn. I don't believe it is Saren's turn. I hear it. Can't be that tower. Hoodle's gone. Oh, there was a chest in there. Hmm. Do you want to grab that before we keep looking? Oh. Well, then how about go back to where Hoodle was showing up at? Not. Don't I have Gravitas filled on the other? Hmm? Uh, on the alternate skill setup? Yeah, you So what's Annihilation actually look like? Perfect opportunity. Oh. Fancy. Thirty. Thirty and thirty. I'll be on my best behavior, even if it is my birthday. 
Thank goodness, if it was Saren, he could literally watch the stream as there would be no audio. <laughs> yeah, that's fair. Saren Solite. Yeah, tomorrow should just be uh, Legends Arceus, so... With a wind scar, and the clouds stretch far. Kisora, what is he doing? Reciting a poem, apparently. Just let him be. <laughs> Chests. Yep, in this tower. And this looks like a nice, uh, uh, safe place to save. Hmm. Wow, you got that without a Pokemon? I've been playing too much Arceus. <laughs> but maybe. I hope you all have enjoyed. It's been fun. I'm glad we got that relic before the end of the stream. He was gunning for it. I really was gunning for it. Works for a few seconds to not for a few seconds. Oh no! How about you only watch while it is working and then you like fast forward through the parts where it's not? Hi hey, everyone. Hope you all have a wonderful rest of the time zone. Uh, we will be back tomorrow with Legends Arceus. Back to a normal schedule. We tried that. Oh. Good night, everybody. Or good day. Or good morning. Good evening. That's why I say good time zone. Much less confusing. Bye, everybody. I checked off.